to the club. All right, you guys, good morning. This is Trina Maria, and it is time for court and caboose. So shoulders to shorts, we're working it today. Let's bring those arms up. I want you to stretch those arms up nice and tall, and then just do a little side bend. Reach up nice and tall, side bend, other side. Brace your core as you just kind of go side to side here for a moment. Good morning, welcome, Ashley. Oh my goodness, just stretch. Stretch from yesterday, stretch from last night. There we go. And then next time you're over on the right, I want you to hinge up the waist, bring those arms down. And we're just gonna kind of do a couple circles. If this doesn't feel good, you can do something else if this feels good. Stick with me here, nice and slow. Here we go, we're gonna go one more this direction. And then we're gonna meet up top, nice and tall, other side. So 12 days of Christmas, trainers are bringing out special workouts. I got one for you. So congratulations, you guys made it to my 12 days of Christmas. Um, court and caboose, here we go. Let's bring those arms up nice and tall. And then I want you to tap and reach the back opposite leg. So I'm not counting. But here's what we're going to do. I have 12 different planks and I've got 12 different squats. <laughs> we're going to alternate between planks and squats all class long. We're going to do one minute rounds, but what we'll do, hold on, and then let's do mummy walks forward and back. I'm going to demo the move for 20 seconds and then we're going to work for 40. So it's going to be 20 seconds of demo, 40 seconds of work. We're going to alternate between plank and squats. Now, if you're one of those members, if you're not comfortable coming down to the ground for plank, that's okay. Here we go. Let's turn it out for a cougar lunge from side to side. You can do all of the moves against the wall or a steady table, and you can do the, uh, that plank move that way. There we go, but we're gonna have some fun. So again, 12 different planks, 12 different squats, here we go. And then let's reach the arms over and across. Right here, we're warming up. We're warming up, we're getting ready. Oh, and this one's a little more unique too because even though we use dumbbells usually in class, today we're gonna go body weight. So we're going crazy today for the workout. And then let's reach across, reach across here. Pivot off that back foot. There we go, so again, I'm gonna demo the move for 20 seconds. We're all gonna do it together for 40. And we're gonna alternate plank, squat, plank, squat. 12 different planks, 12 different squats. Welcome Usha, welcome Lisa, Ashley, Letty, good morning, Emily, Christina, Sally, Carrie, Rosen, good morning, Tracy, Bridget, Don, Susan. All right, so move one, I'm gonna demo it. Or if you know the move, you can do it with me for the minute. It is a classic plank, so again, against the wall or down the ground. We're just gonna set it up, spread those fingers nice and wide, step it back. You want your gaze between your hands, forward about, oops, I'm gonna go this way so I can see the thing. Forward about six inches. And you're gonna just hold the plank. So again, 40 seconds of work. So we'll take that 20 seconds of me demoing the move and then you work for 40. Or again, if you want, you can go for that full minute if you know the move. And again, you can always be up against something for your plank work. So let's have some fun. You guys have 20 more seconds here. This is plank one of 12. 12 planks, Sandra, 12 planks. I'm not messing around today. Good morning, Casey. <laughs> Welcome team. You guys are looking great. There you go, you have 10 more seconds on this, then I'll demo plank number, I mean, squat number one, which is gonna be classic squat. But hold your plank for three, two and one. Come on up out of it. I'm demoing the classic squat. You want your feet about hip distance, maybe slightly wider, toes and knees, same direction, and hinge at the waist, drive the weight until your heels come down and up. So starting in five seconds, I want you to join me. 40 seconds, squats number one. Ready, set, here we go. So again, I got 12 different kinds of squats right now. If you wanted to, you could hold the weight at your chest or you can stick with me and go body weight only. Good morning, Erin. Welcome. There we go. So the 12 days of core caboose. I found a way not to count and still do it. <laughs> so we're doing 12 different planks, 12 different squats. You have 10 more seconds here. 
And then the next one will be the plank. I'll demo it for 20 and then you join me for 40. It's a classic low or forearm uh, plank. So ready, set, here we go. I'm gonna demo it. You have your forearms on the ground, fingers spread nice and wide on your elbows. And then you're either here on your knees, gaze between your hands about at your toe level, or you curl those back toes under and you hold it right here. Against the wall, the forearm might not work so well. So you're gonna go with the classic plank against the wall. Let's go, let's go, 40 seconds. Forearm plank hold. And if 40 seconds is a bit much for you for holding a plank, that's fine, just do what you can. And then you can go into child's pose and then you can get back into it. Welcome Casey, welcome Cheryl. There we go team, we've got it. Right here, plank two of 12, classic forearm plank. And again, you want those fingers spread wide, palms on the ground. You're holding for five more seconds. Hold, hold, hold. All right, come on out of it. Now we're on to squat number two. We're going classic narrow squat. So you're gonna bring those feet together, those toes together, those ankles together, those knees together. Why don't you drive all the energy along the midline, keep that chest lifted as you're gonna squat down, hinge at the waist and come on up. You can add arms to it if you want, 40 seconds. Here we go, narrow squat. So come down and up. I really want you to be thinking about squeezing together those knees, working those inner thighs, 40 seconds here. Good morning, corn caboosers. Let's, let's see, did we beat the attendance of circuit? Oh, not yet. We're getting there, we got 26. Welcome Kristen, welcome Megan, good morning. Misa, that fire looks awesome. <laughs> there you go. And again, if you do not want to go down and up in any of the squats, you could always hold it low and pulse as an option. Here we go, five more seconds. All right, and rest, next one is a genie plank, the standing option. You're gonna be here and you're gonna go side plank to side plank. Otherwise, what makes it a genie on the ground is you're gonna be on your forearms like this and they're gonna open up side plank to side plank. So you're on your forearms, pinky towards the ground. Then you're gonna open up genie and then come back to center. Let's go, let's go, 40 seconds here. And again, you can be on your knees right here. Open up a genie. Let's see, I'll get a little closer. So this is how your forearms are on the ground. Open up to the side, come center. And again, you can be on your knees, on your toes, or on the, on the wall. You can go with the straight arms. That'll be a little bit better so you don't hurt your elbows. And then open up, raise your core. Come side to side. Good morning, Anne-Marie, welcome. Nice, Cheryl. Christina's winning the curtain contest today. I love all the colors of that, that room behind you. There you go, ladies. Five more seconds. Jeannie Plank. Here we go. Three, two, and one. Take a break. We're going to transition. Squat three, plie squat. We do this a ton. Come out to wide stance, turn up those toes and knees 45 degrees. Slide down that imaginary wall, bring that pelvis so it's pointed like down, arms out to the side. And here we go, we're gonna go down and raise those arms up. So sink down and rise up. There you go, looking good team. So again, strength class, shoulders to shorts. We got a different spin on it today. 12 planks, 12 versions of squats. Here we go, five more seconds here. <laughs> All right, and rest. Next one's a T plank. So you're gonna go back to that classic plank, open up to the side plank, back to that classic plank, add in a push up, and then over to the other side. 40 seconds. You ready? Set. Let's go, let's go. Knees or toes. So again, open up to a side plank, bring your gaze up, come back to that classic plank, add in your push up, and then the other side right here. And again, you can be on those knees. Same idea, push up, side plank. Find some length here. Really lift through the side body. Here we're again, against the wall. Always an option. Yes, Sally, looking good, Don. Susan, woo, woo. 
You're closer too, closer to the screen than you normally are. I like that, yes. I'm gonna see those pupils. <laughs> Good morning, welcome Demi, welcome Erica. Here we go, five seconds on this one. You got it, T plank. Three, two, and one. Take a break. <laughs> Come on up. The next one's an in and out squat. So it's gonna be a narrow squat, and then you're gonna add a movement, wide squat, narrow squat, side to side. 40 seconds, starts now. So we already worked on this, this narrow squat, wide squat, this side, toes and knees, pointed forward, pointed forward, chest is lifted, and then you can do what you want with your arms. And again, I know I'm not showing weights today. You could hold weights at your chest if you wanted to and do all sorts of things, or you could go down and up if you wanted to bring up your heart rate or you can keep it right here on those thighs. Always options. This is squat version four of 12. Uh, but you guys are dying to find out what the rest of the workout's gonna look like. Here we go, three, two, one, rest. Next one, side plank. Again, you can go up against the wall, do the same motion, Otherwise, we're gonna come on down, we're gonna do the right arm down for 20, and then the left arm down for 20. So you can be here on your knees or stack it up, and we're just gonna hold. You can bring up the top foot if you want, 20 seconds. Right side first. Long in the spine, stack those hips. Hold for five more seconds, ah! And then transition, other side. Ready, set, side plank hold. Right here. Look at all these strong women. Oh my goodness. Woo. Hold for five, four, three, two, and one. We did it. All right, next up, squat number five. We're adding in some movement. It's gonna be a uh, squat, lunge, squat, lunge, a little combo. So we'll start in 10 seconds. And again, you can always be holding a weight at your chest. So you can be adding in curls. You can be doing all sorts of things or you just stick body weight. Ready, set, 40 seconds of work. Here we go. Squat, lunge, squat, lunge. So this is my go-to modification move when I call out for burpees in class or a president instructor says, do burpees and I'm not feeling burpees, right? This is a great move to do. Speaking of burpees. If you're taking class, come with me next. <laughs> we, got, we have a fun burpee section to do together. And this is one of the modifications. So no, anytime you come to class, there's modifications and options for you. There we go, three more seconds here. All right, we did it. And rest. Next one, plank number six is a reverse plank. So if you are staying standing, if you can find a chair or something, you're gonna hold the chair and you're gonna be like this. I don't know how you would do that against the wall. Otherwise, you're coming down to the ground, bend those knees, hands at the hips, and then you're gonna shoot your hips up. You can stay here or you work to straighten the legs, drive those heels in, open up that chest a little bit. Oh, this one's a little intense. And we hold the reverse plank. You could go a little further, point the toes and really get up there. I haven't done this one in a long time. It's pretty intense. Or you could, again, you could stay in tabletop too right here and shoot those hips up. Otherwise, 10 more seconds and whatever option you're doing here for a sixth plank of the day. Ready, set, and rest. Come on out of it. Oh, this is good. Squat six, figure four squat. So it's a one-legged squat. You can hold on to something or stay standing. You're gonna balance on the right, flex the left foot, squat down, come on up and then switch. Bring out the right foot, come down and then switch. So kick it out, cross at the top of the knee, whew, come on down and then switch. There we go, ladies. And again, other option, you can bring most of your body weight to one leg, squat, most of your weight to the other one, and squat. 
I saw a beautiful thing on Instagram. It was a woman with um, a mechanical leg here all the way down and she was still doing, I'll share it on the member group. She was still push pressing like, I don't know, three, 500 pounds. A lot's possible, right? We just got to train. Here we go. Three, two, and one. Plank number seven. It's a three point plank. So either against the wall on the ground, you're going to go into that first plank and then we're going to play. <laughs> My version of plank. So let's set up that first plank we did and then we're all going to raise open, raise forward our right arm and hold. So that's the three points. The three points are at two legs, not other arm. And then bring it down and then bring up that right leg and hold. Again, you can be on your knees too. Bring it down and now we got the left leg up and hold, three points, bring it down. And then the left arm up, whoo, and hold. Bring it down, we got time for a quick lightning round, 10 seconds, here we go, right arm up, bring it down, right leg up, bring it down, left leg up, bring it down, left arm up, bring it down. Take a break. <laughs> what do you guys think of this workout? <laughs> okay. I got some thumbs up. I got some stank eyes. I'll take it. <laughs> Next up, squat number seven. We're gonna do squats with a heel raise or squat chops. 40 seconds starts now. So we're back to the original squat, but this time we're gonna squat down, add in that heel raise, or if you wanna jump, squat down and add in a hop. I'm not gonna hop personally today. <sighs> I'm gonna stick right here. So again, chest is lifted, weights in your heels here, and then you transition, bring the weight to uh, the pad, landing pad here and come on up. Yes, Carla. Good morning, Miss Linda. This is not counting. Three-legged plank, that was hard. <laughs> Thanks for the feedback. It is the 12 days of core and caboose without counting, just for Linda. I'm glad you're here so you can experience it. Here we go, three, two, and one. Rest. Next one, up down plank. If you're against the wall, instead of an up down plank, you're gonna do shoulder tucks. Otherwise, down on the ground for 40 seconds, you're back into that plank position, and then you're gonna go down to the elbow on one arm, down to the elbow on the other, and then up, up. And then you switch. If your floor is really hard, and it's not feel good on your elbows, the other option on the ground, you can do those shoulder taps, and you got 20 more seconds. Well, this one's challenging. Yes, Misa. Misa's on her way to class 1000. Counting down the days for you. Can't wait to celebrate. There you go, team. Looking good. You got it. Nice and strong. All right, five more seconds here. Plank eight of 12. Here we go. Three, two, one. Shake it out. Next one. We're gonna do a 90 degree squat jump or pivot. So you're gonna come down and squat. And if you're not jumping, you're gonna rise up and then come forward and then back and then 90 degrees this way and back or squat, jump and jump side to side. Let's do it. 40 seconds, come on, come on. So again, if you're not jumping, pivot, come back center, pivot, drop those hips, come side to side. Or again, you can jump. I guess it's 45 degrees. No, that's 90, I think it's 90. Or you're gonna squat, pop. If you're jumping, land soft. And let's do it for 10 more seconds. Oh my goodness. Squat eight of 12, nice Cheryl. Awesome, Sandra. Go Letty. Looking good, Ami. All right, and rest. Whew. Plank nine of 12, classic push-ups, knees, toes, or wall. It's gonna be 40 seconds of work, <laughs> starting in five seconds. It's 40 seconds, no more push-ups. Ready, set, here we go, let's do it. So again, you start in that first plank position, that classic plank position, bring your chest forward a little bit, and then come down and up. That's it. Hold that plank steady, and again, you can drop to those knees or be on your knees. You do not want to be dropping that belly. You want that gaze between your hands. Forward, a smidge. 
and then you're coming down and up. 10 more seconds, ladies. The 12 planks of Christmas right here. Here we go. Three, two, one. Take a break. Where we're at. Next up for those ninth squat. We're gonna squat and jump forward and jump back. If you're not jumping, you're gonna squat, step forward and back and stay low. Otherwise, you're gonna hop forward, hop back for 40 seconds. Ready, set, here we go. So it's either hop forward, hop back, or squat forward, squat back. And stay low if you're doing that squat step. There we go. It's nonsense, it's total nonsense. This is what happens when the trainers all try to do special things for the holidays, right? <laughs> nice, Don. Looking good, Liz. Burn out those legs, ladies. I see all sorts of good options. Five more seconds. Woo! Here we go. All right, and rest. Plank 10 of 12. Plank rainbows. So we're gonna be back in that forearm plank. You're gonna raise your hips up and you're gonna drop them to one side, bring them up center, drop them up other side or against the wall, so arms stay straight. Drop the hips one side, up, other side. 40 seconds. We start now. Let's do it. So again, it's that forearm plank. Raise those hips up, drop them to one side. And again, that gaze. So important for our, our spine to remain neutral, so it's at your, like your thumb level. You're not looking back at your toes. I promise you they're still there. <laughs> Come side to side. <sighs> Here we go, ladies. Woo! We're in it out for five, four, three, two, and one. Rest. Next up. We are doing a split squat, also known as a lunge. Right leg forward, left leg back. And we're going to, uh, thank you, Letty. We're going to um, step it. So right leg forward, left leg back. So you're gonna stay low and you're gonna tap, bring it back. Tap, bring it back. So that phone that just rang was my kid's school. So if it rings again, I will answer it. Hopefully they call my husband and it's fine. If it's important, they'll call back. <laughs> Whew. Never a dull moment, right, ladies? Here we go. Burn out this front leg. Split squat, taps. Right leg is forward. We have five more seconds here. Whew. All right, and rest. Next move, it's um, a low plank to dolphin. Standing option, you're gonna be against the wall. Plank and then shoot those hips back. Otherwise, you're back into that forearm plank. You're going to come on down um, and then you're going to walk your feet towards your hands a little bit, just a couple steps. So you're shooting your hips up and then you're walking them back. If you're on your knees, just bring your knees up a little bit, brace your core, and then walk your knees back. 40 seconds starts now. Oh my goodness, team. So here's the fun of the end of the year, right? We get to mess around and play a little bit, not just in life, but in with the workout the classes and the parties. So we're playing with that theme of 12. 12 planks, 12 <laughs> squats. Woo, there we go. We have five more seconds on this one. All right, and rest. Woo. We're almost there. Squat 11. This one is where I kind of cheated because it's the same move, just other leg. Left leg forward, right leg back. We're all gonna come down to that lunge and then we're gonna tap that back leg forward. Ready, set, so stay low, hips low. Tap, bring it down. Tap, bring it back. I know I technically did not have a, a real break in here the breaks for those 20 seconds of me sharing the move. There you go, we're almost done, but you can always take a break anytime. 
Here we go, 15 seconds here. And then we have our 12th plank to share and our 12th squat to share. And then we'll stretch. You're doing amazing. Here we go, three, two, and one. So hard to think about what the 12th plank should be. And here's what I came to. You're gonna be back to basically plank number one, but I always liked it when Rochelle would do this thing where you kind of make your hands into like a heart and then you have them at your heart level holding the plank. So either up against the wall or down on the ground. It's the last 40 seconds. So get into that regular plank and then put your thumbs together and your next fingers together and then bring, shift your heart forward. So your heart is right above that heart down at your hands and just hold this plank for a moment. So technically 20 more seconds. Thank yourself for coming in and being a warrior in 2021. No joke, not any easier than 2020, right? But you're here, you came to this workout, you're still pushing, you're still working hard. Hold, hold, hold for three, two, one. 20 seconds off. And then the last squat, what should I do, right? <laughs> Here's what I came up with. We're gonna just go with a classic low squat hold. And so we're gonna hold it for 40, very painful seconds, and then we can stretch and recover. So get ready, back to move one. And <laughs> at the waist, sink those hips back. Maybe go into prayer arms, and we're just gonna hold this squat. So squat 12. So this is it. So mostly body weight, core and caboose. Messed around a little bit today. Hope you had some fun. Change is good. I'll go back to classic format next week. <laughs> Hope you're having fun with it. We have 15 more seconds. Maybe get a little lower if your knees and your hips and everything feels okay. Again, thank yourself for coming in. Embrace that burn. That's you getting stronger. Hold for three, two, and one. Come on out. Shake it out. Do you guys feel that one? <laughs> yeah. All right. We got three minutes to cool down. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let's um, turn out those. Actually, we'll turn out the right. Come into the, just this quick warrior two legs for a minute here. Open up the hip. And then you can bring the forearm down. Reach and stretch. Right here. Whew. Beautiful job team today. And then let's turn this foot forward, turn out the left, sink it down, and then bring this forearm down, and then reach and extend here, opening up that side body. All right, and then we'll slowly come on out of that one more figure four squat, this time as a stretch. So we're gonna hold it. So find that balance, or again, hold on to something and then sink those hips back, open up those hips. Thank you guys so much <clears throat> for joining today. Corn Caboose will be back this time on Thursday with Cardio Blast. And I will work to find last year's 12 days of Christmas workout. I usually keep them all. I keep them all unless I look at it and I'm like, oh, I hated that one. And then I do get rid of a few, but I have a feeling I still have it on me, so I'll, I'll look for it. If I do have it, I'll do it on Thursday, or I'll make up a new one. There you go, stretch here. All right, and let's do two breaths together. Squat down, inhale, reach those arms up nice and tall. You guys did amazing today. Exhale, one more time. Squat down, inhale, reach those arms up nice and tall, and exhale down. There you go, team. That's how you kick off a day. Hope you had a good time with that. Bye, everybody. Very festive workout. Yes, we call festive. Well, we're going to call it festive. I like that. Bye, Carla. Bye, Sally. Great to see you, Mom. Bye, Cardone. Bye, Susan. Bye, Demi. Bye, Cheryl. Bye, Casey. Good to see you guys.